bow carving. Let's do this. Pretty early. Hudson, you're good. It's been about a year since we've been out, so um, we like learning from scratch for Huddle again. So we're taking the old boy and going with Chini again. Um, hitting Port Gawler this time, so I've only ever hit Minado with Huddo. So let's see how he goes. A bit tired? Hmm? A bit tired? <laughs> tired. Tired. <laughs> Today. Are you? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want to go fast? That's what I'll be asking. Try right hand, come around here, hold the seat and do it with your right hand. Do it strong with your right. So you have a quick compression switch in there. Yeah, I see what his plan is. Take my arms off the tee.
guy from the car crate. Yeah, that's not meant to be there. Oh, that's just it? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, a bit of duct tape there. Yeah. because you've either gone to the corner too hard or when the go-kart slid around. Or right? when you just full on and then... Pull the brakes, if you hit the yeah. brakes too hard. Or look up the rear like a, like a drift down brake. Because in the back yeah, end you know, locker. You know, yep.
All good? Mm. Fun or what? Yeah, that was very fun. Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Dad. All right, let's go karting done for another time. Um, it is exhausting. So any parents that do it full time and you take your kid racing, go karting, um, yeah, credit to you because it is exhausting, especially trying to get some time. For anyone that hasn't actually done it with their kids, I highly recommend it. Um, my dream has always been to race with my son one on one, and this is only the beginning. As soon as he starts to learn how to chase um, and then put pressure on me from behind and obviously gets into a higher speed go kart, it'll be absolutely awesome. So, um, yeah, definitely recommend it. If you want to try it, just stop making excuses, go and do it with your, with your son or daughter. Um, yeah, you won't regret it. <laughs>